Uh, I'm in legit pain. I am in legit pain. <laughs> I think I need to stop. All right, what's up, guys? It's Grant Johnson, joined by Colton Lentz once again. And if you watched my last video, you know exactly what this is. This is the 5,000 calories in one meal challenge. And honestly, it doesn't look like that much of a challenge. The, the total is 5,094 calories. And we're doing this because of reasons mentioned in my last video. So to find out, you have to watch my last video or follow our Instagrams, my Instagram and Instagram. They'll be right here. And they're also in the description down below. That's where we're the most active and you'll understand why we're doing this by watching the last video, which will also be linked down below or go to our Instagram. So basically we're just gonna try to eat all this. It's 5,094 calories and I'll kind of break it down. We have the uh, pizza, a small pizza from Domino's, which is uh, 15 or 1,560 calories. Then we have the brioche French toast from Perkins, and that is a total of 1,090 calories with all the peanut butter, whipped cream, berries, and syrup, the delicious goodness. And then we have Burger King chicken nuggets and fries, medium fries, and 20 chicken nuggets. That's a total of 940 calories with some barbecue sauce because you need barbecue sauce. If you don't use it with chicken nuggets, it's honestly kind of weird. Um, and then we had a shake. And this and the shake, it's 1,124 calories. And honestly, it's not as much as I thought it would be like volume wise, but it's uh, one scoop of protein, one banana, a half a tub of Ben and Jerry's ice cream, peanut butter, a couple tablespoons, and some almond milk, and then just doubled that. So we're both eating 5,094 calories each. And it's safe to say we're ready to get into it. All right, here we have the pre-meal weigh-ins. First, we have Colton coming up. Let's see what he turns up at. And the scale says 196. Well, remember that. Let's see what he is afterwards. Now my turn. Now my turn. 185.4. So now let's get into the meal. We've been waiting to eat for like how long? Uh, since church. It's like three. What time is it? It's almost three. Two thirty. Yeah, it's two forty-seven. I haven't ate since like actually nine o'clock last night. So that not that long for me, but. I think I gotta go with the French toast first, just cause it just looks so dang good. That's what I was thinking, and then I was looking at the syrup, like it's probably gonna get all soaked up. Oh yeah, true. Gotta get before the syrup gets soaked in, but. It's actually my first time having brioche French toast. Mmm. So what was the carb count on like all of this together? Well, I don't actually know right now, but actually the video, you guys might know, it's probably right here. I'll break it down. <laughs> We're gonna have some clips breaking down like how many calories each thing is, protein, carbs, fat, but I would say it's very high carbs. Mm -hmm. Currently, my little brother is laying on the stairs, staring at us creepily. He just went away since I started talking about him, though. And that is a French toast gone. Brioche French toast is gone, so that's like a thousand calories roughly done for. I think I'm gonna have to go like back and forth between these two. Well, I'm just kind of feeling it. You I'm are? not a big eater, so. Ooh. I guess this yeah. is gonna be tough. I'm known to eat a bit more than Colton, but we kind of we purposely didn't eat for a long time, so we should be in a little better shape for this. But this is turning out to be a lot more food than it looks like. Yeah, this slice right here is just hitting me hard. But looking at it, like the thumbnail, and like at the beginning, it doesn't seem like that much food, but it's 5,000 calories. That's a lot of calories. We could have saved ourselves and made the shake bigger, but. You know, we're hard out here. I don't know about this 
cheeky. And the keys to eat fast, and it's the pizza is just going down so slowly in my throat. This is one of my second piece. I think I need some, some water to go in here. All right, we're gonna go get water. This is my show now. Taking over the channel. Maybe that's what my channel's gonna become. We're just gonna eat a ton of food. And I'm gonna go from being fitness stuff to being fat. Hot dogs. The next Joey Chestnut. Mm. You can't beat Joey. That's not possible. Yeah, he's a beast. 60 something hot dogs or something like that? I think it's in the 70s or close to 80s. Yeah, I just went for the triple nugget dip. That's right. Oofed up. I think I'm gonna try to finish the pizza. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to finish everything, so I'm gonna go for the chicken nuggets, and then pizza, if I don't finish, can be some leftovers. But I'm gonna try. Because pizza is better to warm up than chicken nuggets, for sure. Do you think you'll eat supper? No, not a chance. It's three o'clock. I don't usually eat lunch, most or not lunch, but I usually skip a meal a day. So there's no way. No way I'll eat supper. Maybe like a, a snack before bed, a protein bar or something, but. You know, honestly, I might be able to eat supper just because I feel like my body won't let me get to the point where I'm so full I can't have supper, so I feel like it won't be that bad. And plus, I never skip meals, so it'll almost be weird. I very rarely skip meals. I just let a burp out on my way through. <laughs> I'm feeling, feeling like I can eat it. Get chicken. a puke. Yeah. No, I can puke. I just opened up some more room down there. Mm. Hopefully. Did you put those fries in my plate while I was gone? <clears throat> no. <laughs> Normally it's who ate my fries or who ate my something, like took it off your plate. Now we don't want the food. <laughs> Might have to call up some of our friends. Let's call Jet and have him come over and help finish this. Jet, I hope you're watching this and saw that. The nuggets and fries are gone from both of us. Now we just have pizza and the milkshake. And to be honest, the pizza, it's just not looking good to me at all. That is the milkshake gone for me. And Colton's getting in there. Our next challenge should be now we fast for like two days. Starting now. Actually, it would be a good challenge. I wouldn't like it. Me too, wouldn't it, Owens? How was it? It wasn't that bad. You know, like. You get the initial hunger, mm -hmm. but then you kind of just push through it. It's like when you go on like an extreme cut, you just kind of can push through the hunger and it's like, it's not that bad. Mm -hmm. Plus 24 hours, 48 hours is nothing. Sure. Jesus fasted for 40 days and 40 nights. Yeah. Nobody's beating his record. In the desert. Yep, in the desert. So it was hot. Probably made it worse. Did he have water? I don't know. I wasn't there. <laughs> True. There was a, a priest or someone or a pastor that tried to do what Jesus did for 40 days, fast for 40 days, and I'm pretty sure he died. Well, that just shows not beating that record. I'm in legit pain. I am in legit pain. <laughs> I think I need to stop. I'm going to take these two bites and I'm done. I'm in pain. Really? Yeah. Like, this is bad. <laughs> 
Oh gosh. Oh. I am done. Ooh, Colton's tapping out. How many pieces of pizza you have left? Mm. Four. With four pieces left, he's tapping out. I can't. I think I can keep going. I think I can. I have no pets. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. Now I'm obligated to eat my crust because I call people out for not eating it. I shouldn't have done that. Are yeah, you hypocrite? <laughs> hypocrite. <laughs> Alright, we're back. The maximum recording time happened, so we must have been like recording for 30 minutes or so. But. I decided to tap out. Colton tapped out with like four or five pieces left. Five left. Five left, and I've got two left, but it's just not worth it. And especially when I got up to go turn on the camera again, it just felt not good at all. So and maybe I'll finish my water, help me feel a little better, but I'm definitely gonna have to pay a visit to the bathroom. <laughs> oh, what do you think about the whole thing? You know, I thought it was fun. It was interesting, but it's not my kind of challenge. It's yeah. just almost like torture, and like it's just not something you're gonna. I like to do because I'm just gonna feel like not good for the rest of the day. And like there's no enjoyment in it. Yeah, it's enjoyable. Like the French toast, that was the enjoyable part. <laughs> I mean, it tasted good, but man, it was just, it was, it was hard, and I don't want to do it again for a long time. Maybe I will sometime. Maybe I'll do like a 10,000 calories in one day thing for you guys, which I feel like would be easier. But for now, we're not doing one of these for a while. But it was fun. I mean, 5,000 calories is a lot of calories. But I think that's gonna do it for us. We hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and also check out the last YouTube video, which is linked down below where we talked about our fitness, like our calorie burning challenge that we did over on Instagram, which are also linked down below, go follow us there. But yeah, I don't have much else to say. I kind of just want to quit talking so I can go to the bathroom. <coughs> Goodbye. All right, another thing, I forgot to weigh myself, but here's gonna be my weight. I'll let you guys watch it with me. Well, actually, I gotta put you down, and then I'll tell you what I weigh. 188.2, so I don't think I really gained weight. Let's see. Oh, I gained three pounds, I think. I don't remember what Colton's was, and I forgot to have him weigh before he left, but I'll put that right here. There's Colton's weight. Actually, I'm back, guys. I went to use the bathroom, but then I remembered I didn't tell you guys what the total calories, carbs, protein, fats were for this whole thing, roughly. If I can find all of them, I'll do that. For sure, the total calories and also the price of everything. We bought everything. Only thing we made here at my house was the, the shake. So um, I'll, have the, I'll have them all listed right here. The total calories, total price, total fats, carbs, everything. But yeah, thanks for watching. For real, love you guys. Really appreciate everything. Don't forget to like and subscribe. It means a lot. And follow me on my Instagram. Follow Colton on his Instagram. Watch the last video. Just show some love everywhere. We really appreciate it, I really appreciate it, and I will see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.